What is up, gang? It is your favorite president here, the one, the only Donald the Great. I am joined here by Barack and Joey in order to make the best cookie tier list on the face of this planet. Although I will admit we couldn't think of more cookies, so please let us know which ones we're missing. Well, right off the bat, I can tell you that we're missing animal crackers. Shut up, Sleepy Joe. That's a cracker, not a cookie. What's the difference? Like, genuinely, what is different? Uh, anyways, let's go ahead and get this list started, and we got some Nutter Butters coming up first. I personally am not a huge fan of these, but I don't judge people who like them. Ooh, I love these things. I shove so many nutters in my mouth that it gets all dry and becomes one big glob of nut in my mouth. Never mind, I most definitely judge people who like them, and I'm now putting this into C tier. That's a solid placement, despite what Joey regurgitated out of his mouth. I know my cookies, what can I say? And up next, well, we got some cream pies, and oh boy, I love me some cream pies. I personally can't get enough of them. We are talking about the cookies, right? Yeah, so I'd put cream pies in S tier, but the cookies go into C tier alongside the Nutter Butter. Up next, we got our tried and true Oreos. I feel like we all know where this is going. There's no way people can argue against Oreos being in the Cookie Hall of Fame. This goes right into S tier. I love Oreos so much, but if I eat too many, I get like really bad stomach cramps and then my shit looks like tar when it comes out. Joey, dude, what the hell? What if people are eating while watching this tier list? Joey doesn't care. Joey simply voices the truth. Joey, stop talking about yourself in third person anyways. I then have grandma's cookies going into A tier. I don't know why, but whenever I have these, they always hit. Like, I can't explain to you all why, but just know that these always bang when I grab them. And after that, we got knots. And these cookies are pretty good, I can't even lie. A solid B tier for me, but I enjoy the fruity flavor mixed with the cookie. I'm seeing a whole bunch of boxes up next. What the hell are those things? Something I'd advise the sellers of to avoid you at all moments possible. Send a Girl Scout to Joey's house, and that's basically game over. Little girl gonna come out of Joe's red screen like in COD. But yeah, the cookies, though, I would rate an S tier. We could go into a tier list of flavors for the fans. But as of now, we are rating them as a whole. And the Samoas are simply elite, and that alone places them that high. Solid selection here, Donald. I will twerk for Girl Scout cookies any day of the week. Those cookies must have nicotine or something inside of them. Thank you, Barack. I'm glad someone appreciates Samoas as much as I do. Anyways, we got Keebler cookies, and with their fudge stripes alone, I'm putting them into S tier. I was thinking A tier, maybe, but I smack on those cookies way too often, and they taste different from the other options. Like, I feel like they're more unique. I'd agree with that, actually. Keebler cookies are banging, and they separate themselves from other cookies as well. Joe, don't just go repeating what I said so that you seem smart, you mouth breather. Up next, we got Famous Amos cookies, and I like them, but I believe they're slightly worse than Grandma's, so I am putting them into B tier because of it, but more importantly, guys, we have my Nillas up next. I love my Nillas. Whenever I see a Nilla, I go, what up, my Nilla? Okay, stop the cap and stop the corny joke, Donald. You are going to get us canceled, and I will personally go and make you choke on Nillas if we ever do. All right, relax, relax. Yeah, truthfully, Nillas are ass and go into D tier, to be honest. I don't really like them all that much. But the same cannot be said for these next ones. And those are Chips Ahoy. God, I love these things. And I'm putting them into A tier. My favorite thing to do while eating Chips Ahoy is to fill up a glass with those cookies and then pour milk till it fills up to the brim. And then over time, the cookies get mushy and perfect. And I scoop them out with a spoon and then drink the cookie water and get the chocolate chips at the end. That sounds like straight ass, Joey. Like you're drinking a bunch of dookie water, just dunk your cookies into the milk like a normal person. Anyways, lastly, we got Walmart sugar cookies and they're okay. Like you know what you're getting with these and they aren't Nilla's, so I put them into C tier, to be honest. The sugar cookies are pretty good. I like them a bit more than C tier, if I'm being honest. Yeah, I bet your Nilla's love them too. You motherfucker. <laughs> Thank you.